Hello friends and welcome to another exciting season of Team Jesus Outdoors. Hey guys, today I'm bringing you the very first Detroit River Report. I know a lot of you have been looking forward to the river reports with the mild winter we've had and this crazy spring-like weather so early we've had this year. I know some of you guys are dying to know what's the what's the condition of the river. Like me, many of you guys have seen some Facebook reports of some guys catching fish. I know my buddy Thad Shelton, he's been out, he's caught some fish. But hey guys, before you get too excited, you might want to keep in mind March is always a tough time for jigging walleye in the Detroit River. Whether we have an early spring, a late spring, doesn't really matter. The water temp's always low to mid 30s. Typically the water's pretty muddy. And right now the, this river is a filthy mess. Hey guys, the good news is I am very confident we are going to get to do some early fishing this year. In fact, I see I see two boats now up here just under the bridge. But I promise you those guys are struggling. The toughest water to fish in for almost any species I've ever fished for. The toughest water to fish in is cold, dirty water. 33 or 34 degree water is tough enough to fish in at any time. But when you've got 32 or 34 or 33 degree water that looks like double, double coffee, that's going to be really tough fishing. So guys, the bottom line is it is early still. I'm convinced we will get out here. We will get to do some early fishing this year. Probably going to be some good fishing early in April, late late in March, early in April. But right now, guys, the river's still cold and muddy. I wouldn't get too excited about the fact that there's no ice in here and we can get boats in. Guys, a lot of the boat ramps are still not open. Um, you know, at the lower end of the river, you got the Metro Park. Lake Erie Metro, it's been open all winter. Mid River, you've got Bellinger Park. The city of River Rouge does a great job of having that park open early and late every year. Kudos to those guys. Bellinger Park is probably the most reliable ramp on the river day in and day out. But guys, in any case, still a little bit early forecast this coming week is for highs in the 30s, lows in the 20s. Any water temp that we've picked up over the last few days, we're going to lose it next week when it's going to fall right back down there. But hey guys, thanks for watching another episode of Team Jesus Outdoors. Guys, make sure you click that subscribe button. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel so that you catch all of our Detroit River reports. We'll have a bunch of reports for you this year as usual. Guys, make sure to smash that like button. Guys, do us a favor and share these videos across your social media platforms. Guys, we're fast approaching 4,400 subscribers. I really believe we'll probably hit 5,000 subscribers this year. I was hoping we'd hit it last year. We did not, but guys, if you want to help us grow the channel, help us grow our reach, The, two, the, the best things you guys can do for us is to hit that like button, leave comments, share these videos across your social media platforms. And guys, we can always use your financial support. If you have any desire to support us financially, you can go to our Patreon account. There's a link to our Patreon account from the YouTube homepage in the upper right hand corner. There's also a link to our Patreon account from our website at www.teamjesusoutdoors.com 
in the upper right hand corner there's a link there's a tab you click on that tab and it'll take you it'll open a link to our patreon account but guys thanks for all your support get them boats ready it's almost time to make sure you're stocked up on those jigs stocked up on those stinger hooks hey god bless tight lines we'll see you guys on the river